Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to more Virtue's Last Reward, where we did the the betrayal of Alice, but this time she allied, and uh, then we were in this room, which was, is called the control room. Yep. Pretty big room. Let's start clicking on stuff. This looks like it's the control panel. It's covered with screens and buttons and so on. Yeah. Don't say. I'm assuming we don't click on any of it then. Shh. This Probably one. not. This one looks like something. The test clipboard. I cannot. I can barely see that E if there is one. <laughs> it's uh, a really light cyan. Oh. Laptop. It's got something on the screen. It's the letter T. Huh. Did you see that thing plugged into the side of the laptop? Yeah, it looks like a memory stick. Is that what they're calling them these days? A USB memory scanner. <laughs> <laughs> or, or as, as the elders would call it a flash drive. <laughs> huh? The screen changed. Do you think it's because you pulled that thing out? Do you think this picture was taken with the laptop camera? There are two bundles of folded cardboard boxes. Just like the ones behind us. Mm. Um, look at the space between the boxes on the left and the wall. Is there something there? Yeah, there is. Let's go take a look. Okay, let me just swoosh on around. I guess I should have went the other way. This is like the first time in a while. I, I have two characters I'm voicing in the same room. Meanwhile, yeah. Maya has it a lot. Yeah. I've had rooms where I am every single person. True. <laughs> These are boxes we saw on the laptop screen. Okay, let's try moving them. The numbers clipboard. Can I combine it with test? No. Uh, let me read that. Which one? Other one. This one. Five nine six two six seven eight three one two one four seven three one four. There's a hidden five four. there. Oh no, I can't no, see. There, I cannot there, see those science at all. The five is the first <laughs> one. <Yeah. laughs> well, I mean, in all fairness, they're like really light. So. Well, that's cool. Okay, what's this? A red clock. It says one one four one hundred sec on the face. Not sure why. Who no. knows? Let's investigate this. And that. Protractor. The compass, which goes with the protractor. Oh no. Can I combine them? I'm going to involve math. I hate this. Expanded compass. A cardboard box filled with complicated machinery. Do you think we can use it? I don't even know what it is. Some cardboard boxes. There's some machinery inside, but we didn't know what it's for. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything useful here. Hmm, these look promising. Let's see here. Darn, I can't understand any of this. Is it some kind of code? None of these have anything useful. So much for that. Maybe it's just lead. Uh, <laughs> papers. They're filled well, with knows all about that. Hope. Yeah. Point out that when he read lad and he said, "Are these even? Are these even?" What did he suppose is exact wording? I can't remember, but he he really does not recognize lad. Yeah. He's like, "Are these even letters?" I'm like, "Is it the Latin alphabet? Like the same letters though? You should like recognize them." <laughs> right. Weird clock. This is five ten minutes on the face. That's a long time. 
Yes, it is. Yeah. Our, our, our favorite lockers are back. No oh, pie. The heck? This sheet has on and off written on it a bunch of times. There's a tiny hole in the middle of the paper that looks like it was made with a needle. So, I just put the compass needle in here. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. So you use the compass to make a circle. And now the circle touches specific words. Maybe those words are a clue. Who knows? We'll come back to that. What is this? Oh, this is that puzzle from the other room again. <laughs> the one we solved accidentally, instantly. Oh, right. <laughs> we just, like, wiped them all down. <laughs> Immediately worked. And look, they're all down already, too, on this one. Maybe you just flipped them all up. Well, there's, it's missing a piece, so we need to find that. Oh, right. It's a tall screen. I don't think it's turned on. Maybe I can't get power for some reason. What about this thing? What is this? It's got a plus sign in. What is this thing? It's huge. I would guess it's used to analyze things. It looks like it's missing a part, though. Fascinating. Let me swoosh on out of here. Whoa, levers. Okay, that's where that other paper is probably in, coming in handy. So it's a control panel. It's covered with screens and buttons and so I'll be back for that. I want to check the rest of the room. Looks like there's a few different books here. We've got some sort of dense technical thing and a novel. Hmm. Doesn't look like there are any clues here, though. Dang. These are all wrapped up in pee pee bands. Pee pee bands. Rope made of poly. pure. polypropylene. What was something new every day? Board. Some cardboard boxes. Doesn't look like there's anything useful. Good old pee pee tape. You start here and then go. Shh. Just give me a second. I should break that down. And the notebook. So many filled pages. Assuming you go clockwise, it would be on. In the middle count too, because that's up. Uh, that would also be off. Let's go try them. Swoosh on over here. I won't even begin to know what it's even talking about. There's these, right? So. Okay, I think you can move these. Oh, you're right. It says off. On the top and on in the bottom. Hmm. Okay, okay, I have the troll. It oh broke. Oh my god, it broke. <laughs> S Sigma! What are you doing? Don't break it. Oh, no, it wasn't me. It just fell off. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, it's off now, so no point crying over spilt lovers. Maybe we can use it somewhere else. Like where? Like on that puzzle that we solved that other time. Oh, maybe. Okay, assuming I was right, this is like how it was set up. So maybe that's why it came off and silly. Anyway, let's swoosh on back over here. What's this? It's got all these pipes. 
black and yellow lever. It says power under it. Do you think this tubing has electrical cables in it or something? Maybe flipping these levers will let us change the amount of electrical electrical current. What would that accomplish? I don't know. Well, I'm guessing the power levelers lever is some is the source. Oh my god. Hmm. Might as well give it up. Wait. Don't get ahead of yourself. Look at the 320. Oh. The lever's missing. Without a replacement lever, I don't think we'll be able to do anything. Oh, looks like you already have it. You're already a step ahead. Huh? <laughs> You've got a lever right there. Should fit perfectly. Energy C. Okay, if I just put it here. Good, there we go. What happens if I hit pull the lever? What should I do with this thing? We found a menu on the floor over there. <laughs> it says that this machine doesn't really use electricity in a conventional way. Huh? Those tubes are some sort of... Use some sort of special liquid to transmit electricity. Actually, it's pretty complicated. The simple version is that you can adjust the voltage by adjusting the flow of the liquid. So let's say you turn the right most lever all the way to the left. If you do that, then all the liquid coming from 20... from 240 will go to the left tube. Turn it all the way to the right, and it goes to the right tube. What if you put it in the middle? Then it goes halved. Each pipe will end up 120 instead of getting 240. So what's the deal with the question marks? Those represent unknowns in the target values. The ones with the three question marks means it's supposed to be a three-digit number, while the ones with the only with <laughs> only two mean that there are two-digit numbers. <laughs> and of course, the single question mark means that the value is only a single digit. What about the ones that starts with three? Well, I would guess that this means the hundreds digits has to be three. So, four <laughs> means the tenth digit has to be four. And question mark, question mark five means that the ones digit has to be five, right? Yes, I think so. So let me see if I've got this. We need to adjust the levers so that the liquid gives us the right numbers on the bottom. That's correct. Once you've got all the levers set, that... Oh my god. Then I think you pull down the lever, the power level like this. Ah, it makes sense. I think that about covers it. Oh, wait, <laughs> one more thing. The liquid will only fill from the top to the bottom. The manual was very specific about that. Okay, let's do this thing. Finally, able to touch it. Okay, let's. I love explaining things to my son. Failure. Okay, the ship. We'll get her next time. Ah. Uh, this is going to suck. I can already tell. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm too lazy for this. Let's run away. Darn, <laughs> I can't figure it out. You can do it, Sigma. Are there any other puzzles I can do? <laughs> I... I don't believe there is, unfortunately. No. What happens if I plug this back in? Let's try plugging this thing in again. on the screen. E. We're totally radical. What does it mean? Don't 
don't know what any of this means. There's a line on this side. Does that mean anything? I think this is a memory card. What? Unless I missed my guess, it's actually a portable scanner. See? There's a thin slit on the end. Just wave part that part over any images or text you want to scan. Then you can just plug it back into the laptop. And look at whatever you scan. Neat. So like... Now it's green. Oh. So oh. I knew it was up. Look at the screen. Huh. It changed. This is like seven... Two, one, three. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah. Now I already did that, right? Find it with that. Now it's yellow. Look okay, it back here. Oh, hey, the screen's blue now. This is. Wait, what? <laughs> I, okay. This okay. is probably the bonus. We accidentally did bonus, I guess. Maybe. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like a password. You think this is for the panel and the safe? I assume so. Okay. I'll be back. I hope it's not the gold folder because this would like, suck. Imagine I if we could just leave, like this. we somehow skipped everything. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> A safe. Looks like there's the ones. <laughs> Looks like the ones I saw in the AV room in the infirmary. So if we put in a password, it should open. Looks like it works the same way too. Oh, it was gold. Okay, so it's it's the folder. Yeah. Piece of cake. Gold file. Quiet. There's nothing else here. We do have to do the pipe puzzle. Wow, this game sucks. Swoos away. Maya, we... We need to stop avoiding our problems. And wait, wait. We also got that... Those numbers, 7213 or whatever. You're right. We never tried these at all. That one's the clocks. I'll do that later. This is the one we just did. This locker, look, look, this locker looks like the ones in the crew quarters. Even the puzzle panel looks similar. Let's figure out how this works first. Being is hard. So this side must be seven. Just seven. Just seven. And then we need just two by itself. Where's a two? A four. Two at the bottom left. And that would two be four at the top times right. two, though. No, I mean, that would be two times four, though. I need just two. Two plus zero. That would be two. And one. One times... Oh, never mind. One times zero. Two zero. divided by two should be one. Right. And then three would be... One plus two. I hate math so much. <laughs> It's great. Anyway, it's excellent. Great. Unlocked. Good work. Now open it up. Disc shaped apart. I am so glad you like math. Because <laughs> I despise it. <laughs> Anytime there's anything math related, I will ask you for help. <laughs> uh, looks like it would fit. Here we go. Nice. I assume Looks we need more. Like 
a sci-fi thing. Let's see, five, ten minutes. Okay. A billion seconds. Once you're finished looking at that, I want to. I want so you to go to the right some more. Yeah, red clock. Okay, stop. Let me just click on this real quick, okay? Oh, okay. Blue, okay. So, on the bottom shelf right there, to the left. This? The black thing, yeah. That's where we got the protractor stuff. Oh, right, I remember. It was at the beginning, so it's been so long. <laughs> It's been like 10 minutes yet. Okay, let's see. Yeah, so long. This locker here. looks like the ones in the crew quarters. The puzzle bit of so Let's see here. Okay, hours and minutes. So I need to convert them into hours and minutes. Give me one second while I do that. Does this game have a handy dandy calculator like the other one did? I don't see a handy dandy calculator button. Nope. Okay. Oh, five ten divided by sixty would be what? <laughs> you wait, but huh? Let's see, five ten divided by sixty I <laughs> Let me use my calculator on my I got this, don't worry. Yes. No calculators for the men. Okay, apparently it is, if I had to guess, this one is... 8.5, which is the equivalent of 8 hours and 30 minutes. And that's for the red one. But we're doing the blue one first, which is why I should have led with that. But... Okay. Okay. I will do that on a calculator too. Give me one second. One one forty divided by six is one ninety minutes. So one ninety divided by sixty, which is the same as nineteen divided by six. Would it be three and one sixth, I want to say. Which is three hours and one sixth would be ten minutes. Let's now we just need to select them on here. Hope everybody my, enjoyed that nothing happening on screen. My brain is fried. <laughs> okay, first, three. I must create a three. There. Okay, and then the minutes would be ten, so... Six plus four. And then for the red one, I need eight. Six plus two. Followed by thirty. Thirteen plus seventeen. Uh, yes, thinking, but yes. Oh, no. wait, what? Wait, thirteen. I did something wrong. I no, no, Ben, that's right. That no. would be thirty. Yes, but I'm saying my math is probably wrong. So. That should be three. 
Yeah, it's three. This should be ten. Mm-hmm. Eight. Mm-hmm. And then thirty. Okay, I did something wrong. Yeah, I'm confused. Since the calculator isn't in game, I can't even show my work. Okay. <laughs> you don't need to show your work. This isn't math class. Hated whenever teachers it like made you show your work. I'm like, I got the answer, damn it. Leave me alone. Should be ten minutes. Getting the same answers, that's not good. I just no wait. Yeah, I'm one out of no. It would not be. Give me one second. Oh, wait, would it? Six. One second. No, it should be ten. I was right. Then why not work? Let's do the other one again. Let's. I got all the same numbers again, and nothing is different. But... Okay. Yeah, I, I read have something no wrong. <laughs> I don't get it. There are four spots I need to fill. In the right numbers, and press enter. It should unlock. Unless it's not like... It's not like the total. It's like, give it the time in... No, because then it would be way too long. Way too much. Wait, this one's the red one. Yeah, I did that. It's the red, red, red. No, wait. Did I do the wrong colors? That might have just been it. I did the colors back. Oh, yeah, because the outer rim. I just had the wrong color associated with the wrong one. It was the right password, just backwards. Let's do it again. Let's. The blue one, which is the correct blue one this time, should be the eight, followed by the thirty, and the red one is the three, followed by the ten. Oh my goodness. I just dumb. <laughs> You're not dumb. <laughs> you did it. It unlocked. See, you if you can open it. Oh, see if you can open it. Wow, wow. the rainbow tree roots. Oh, wow. Fabulous. Looks like something that's untextured. <laughs> Put it in here. It's shaped like a ring. The light in the middle is off. The bottom is all gear shaped. Can I put it in there? I think I could put that rainbow colored root here. Yeah. Now what? Does it work? It's, oh wait, I need to. Now we need to do the puzzle that we've been avoiding. Oh. This sucks. I'm trying to think of 
there's any of them. It's enough to work with here. Oh, and there's so many uh, variables. Needs to be a single digit. Can that single digit be zero? So if that's true, then we want nothing to go that way at all. Like that needs to be done. Okay, no good with that. Doesn't tell me what we're getting in the meantime, is it? So. <laughs> Just gonna assume. Three twenty is going this way, which means this would be three twenty. So in order to get it not three twenty, we would need to add. Let me get the calculator again. Three twenty plus one twenty. Digits though. See, half of this would be 120, so when it gets to here, half of that would be 60. Well, and something interesting now, though, you might have already noticed this. There's green little dots below two of them, and the other are red. Oh my goodness, so I'm right already? <laughs> <laughs> well, you're right on two of them, apparently. If that's anything to go by. You're, 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 it's, you're, it's so good that you are here because I wouldn't have noticed that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so like I was right to do that to get this right. I'm still working on the rest. Wait, does it only update when I do this or does it update in real time? Oh yes, it updates when we do that. Oh. Yeah. How interesting. That's awful. Seems you've got to see that a lot. Yeah. This it no work. That needs to go this way because nothing. Nothing. It needs to, some needs to, so this needs to be like that. Which makes that green, but then this isn't good enough. If I do this, that'll break it up. No, now they're all good somehow. Okay. Oh my goodness. Now we just need to dick around on this side. This side, because then we would interfere with that side, so let's try that. that 120 oh my goodness well it's half of whatever 210 is so it'd be 105 but then half of that which would be hard because it's half okay, 120 goes this way the 120 on that side combines with One of uh, 
points that much. Let's divide that into two. Plus one twenty. Sweet, that shot should be good then, but it isn't. <laughs> so I missed something. You can always just brute force it. How though? <laughs> I mean, just like flip one lever one way, and then flip the all the all the other ones in another way until you get your desired. There we go. There you go. <laughs> Brute force it. Yes, I am a champion. <laughs> Look. I am a champion. We are the champion. <laughs> it turned the power on. Look. It's moving. Looks like it's finally ready. But ready for what? Well... Ready for you to use this, I'm guessing. The screen? Yeah. I think. <laughs> Swoosh on in there. I think I've got it. This machine is for C is a CT scanner. You mean like from a hospital? Yes. One of those things that can take pictures of cross section of your brain and organs and stuff. <laughs> no. <laughs> it can image things other than the human body too. Like this root, for instance. Hmm. So, what we're seeing in on the left is the slice of that root. I think so. What are we supposed to do then? I think try on error is going to be the best way to figure this one out. Just starting to mess with it. and Just start messing with it and we'll see what happens. Alright. The usual strategy then. Hit the X button and press the left stick up and down where the image of the root is displayed to scroll between layers. The bottom layer has eight circles of different colors. Four of those circles are blank. Assign appropriate number to each circle. So, um... The numbers you can use are displayed below the cross section. Grab a number with the X button and move it with the left stick. Here goes nothing. So maybe I could do like this. It's rainbowy, and then it's like less rainbowy. Oh no, it's more math. Oh god. I don't understand what it even is. Four or six. Okay. Four, sixteen, nineteen. What does it, what does it mean? What do the numbers mean? Well, it's 100 at the top. Okay, that makes sense. I guess. It does it. They all add up to 100. Uh, so I guess. But what does this side mean then? Ah. <laughs> uh... Well, obviously they are ratios. The the only weird part is that the bottom numbers don't line up in either one of them. Well, first, we gotta make the this line up. I guess. Give me one second. Where is my calculator? Which I should totally just add to the screen so people can see it, but I'm too lazy. So just assume I'm doing math. 
Yes. Yeah, she's actually doing this all in her head. She's just like a super genius. She doesn't want people to know. I've used science to determine that yellow is 25. Science. <laughs> Math, I mean. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, and I shall use science. One second, I throw it. And I have determined that red is 20. Red is 20? Yes, what I am doing is making common denominators of 100. Oh. Uh, so I'm changing the 16 to 100, which means the 4 is actually a 25. And now I just did the same with red, so that 3 is actually 20. And I shall do the same with green, and then blue we have no idea, but we can kind of guess what it probably is from what's left. At least the bottom one. I bow down to your prowess. <laughs> have have fun with your mathy stuff. And I have determined that green is actually thirty. Sure. If we add those up, forty-five plus thirty would have twenty-five left. So my guess is that blue is actually 25. That's my guess. Now that we finish that part... What do the numbers down here mean is what we must discover. So maybe they need to add up to the numbers we just described. So yellow, 19 plus 6 would create the 5, right? 25, I mean. Yes. The red needs to be 20, so... Yes. The green needs to be 30, so... And the blue also needs to be 25, so... Okay, it was easy puzzle, easy puzzle. Oh my, <laughs> yeah, easy puzzle. I, I would not... Have known I'll that take that puzzle all. a million times over the one just to the left of it. Even though all I had to do was just move things, but any <laughs> oh, <laughs> looks like I got it. <laughs> you sure did. That's amazing. Good work. There it is, the green screen, aka the the right not the bonus. But would you look at that? Right. <laughs> the color changed. Hmm. I wonder. Have a look, Sigma. This is... The sun, the moon, the sun. Yeah. Okay, I wrote it down. I knew it. You've seen a password like this before, haven't you, Luna? Yes. In the EV room in the infirmary. It'll open the safe, right? Yeah. We did it. We already got already the bonus. So conversation. Yeah. Oh, sorry. We've had it like 20 times in this playthrough or something. Yes. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Did you? Yes, it opened. What, what goodies do we got for today? Let's get our prizes. First, we've got... <laughs> Map. <laughs> it says floor B. The one we found in the crew quarters said floor A. No way. <laughs> so did the one in the infirmary. Hmm. 
We came down here using an elevator, right? So that would make A the top floor. Seems weird. Don't the numbers usually count up from the bottom floor? Well, look at it this way. A from above, B from below. Why does that seem ominous? Whatever, moving on. Our next prize is... Let's see. E cards. They have immune on them. Immune on them. Immune. <laughs> that means these are the immune cards the announcer was talking about. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm over it. I'm gonna bite you. Damn it. How dare you? Hmm. Embarrassing me. Now we can play the next AB game. They give us two, just like with the sun cards. Emma Solo, so I'll take one. That's fine with you guys, right? No, we take them both so that you can never betray us. Sure, <laughs> go for it. We've got two other things left here. I've seen one of them before, but this one. Is it some kind of input device? Device. Oh god. <laughs> it has a keyboard on it. Maybe it's some sort of input for a bomb, maybe? Oh, maybe. <laughs> and a cable connected to the top. We can worry about that later. Might as well take it with us for now, though. And finally... The key. We can get out now. <laughs> yeah. We should unlock the exit. He found it safe. <laughs> no more screwing around. Let's move. Okay, where's the exit door? This one. I wonder what this room was anyway. Oh? You didn't notice. Notice what? The thing on the other side of the glass that looked kind of like a metal octopus. I think that maybe that's an annihilation reactor. A annihilation? You mean like that bomb? Yes. The core of the annihilation bomb would work on the same principles. I think Fi knows a lot more about these things than me, though. Well, I wouldn't say that. I've just picked up on a few tidbits of information here and there. Tidbits, huh? If it is what Luna thinks, it should be pretty simple. There's going to be a bunch of matter and antimatter in there. Probably hydrogen and antihydrogen bumping into one another. When they do, they, an they annihilate one another. That's where you get the name and release a bunch of energy. You can actually calculate how much energy by taking the mass defect and- Gah, stop. Too complicated. You're saying that octopus thing is a machine that runs off annihilation energy, right? Well, machine is a weird way to put it. It's more like an engine, like a steam engine or an eternal combustion engine. Just better. All the electricity in this facility is generated by Mr. Octopus. So that would make this room... Yes. This is Mr. Octopus's <laughs> control room. Mr. Octopus, that's the name of this episode right now. Yeah, Mr. Octopus. I guess it doesn't really matter what the octopus is at this point. We're all done with this room. All we've got to do is insert the key. Okay, let's go. Yes, let's. I agree. Three, two, one. Open the tab. An ambidex gate. Uh, must be has Dio been again. Open. Forty-five <laughs> minutes. Here comes Dio. Huh? What's going on? Maybe someone from another team opened one of them. They must have found a moon card. But why the heck would they just go and open one of the doors on their own? We should get back upstairs. Whoever jumped the gun is probably in the warehouse. 
Right. Okay, let's go. It's okay, we're literally right next to the elevator this time. Oh, very lucky of us. We'll sprint down the hall. Did it, did it. Warehouse A. We leapt out of the magenta door and into the warehouse. There stood Ten Yuji, Dio, and Clover. Hey, what the heck is this? Why'd you open one of the AB rooms before the rest of us got back? Clover and I haven't done anything. Dio didn't feel like waiting, I guess. <laughs> you got a problem? <laughs> yes, yes, I do have a Why? problem. Why? I don't remember saying anything about waiting until everyone got back to open the AB rooms. Are you kidding me? We didn't talk about it because we thought it was com common sense. Sigma's right. We were able to get back quickly, but... The others could still be stuck somewhere. What if they can't get back in time? No sooner were the words out of her mouth. Oh, thank goodness. They're all here. Did something happen? Yes. It's Quark, you see? Oh, he no, not... <laughs> no, here we what? go again. What happened to Quark? He collapsed. It happened so suddenly. Oh, we were just searching our room. It's like necessary for all timelines. <laughs> yeah, and then Alice is gonna catch the plague too. What? Please, we must hurry to the infirmary. This condition could change at any moment. You should go. Oh no. Wow. Miyuji shoved Kay aside and leapt through the yellow door. The rest of us exchanged a few startled looks, then ran off after. Quark, come on, kid. Get a hold of yourself. Kamiji grabbed Quark's shoulders and began to shake him desperately. It was Clover who stopped him. Uh, hey, what are you doing? He's sick, and we don't even know what's wrong with him. What if you make him worse? <sighs> then what am I supposed to do? I have to save him. Save? Well, that seems a little extreme. Maybe he just has anemia or something. No, that's not it. I know him better than any of you. He doesn't have anemia. He's never just collapsed before. Well, then call an ambulance and stop freaking out about it. You son of a bitch. This is serious. <laughs> the infirmary seems pretty well equipped. There are plenty of diagnostic tools, but without a doctor, there's not going to be much we can do with it. Oh, right. Well, we've got Luna. Luna. Uh, that's right. I'm gonna Dio skip a little something. because this is mostly similar. You have a yeah, reason. wait. It's, it's that going true? to be the same, more or less. Yeah. You please. Okay, I'll see what I can. I think that machine. It's called an ad. It uses new. Even computer. regardless of like yes. a few like one I note don't lines. Know. Just let us know if you need any. It isn't going to be like insanely different. I don't think. Until it suddenly is really different. That's how these things right. happen. Uh, well, I, I feel so Quark. Oh no. Yes, he's oh, been no. Oh no. Uh, I told Al Spy and I heard Radical Six. He can't how could he have got Why wasn't it pause? There must be something how can we cure Well, Adam says that's the only way Excel Where would you be in the infer we looked around. I don't I'm asking Luna. I'm sorry, Bio's telling we didn't find any. Damn it. What about the other room? Sigma, what about In the control room, all that had was a bunch of stuff for controlling the generator. I don't think anybody would put medicine there. Uh, what about you, Kay? Was there any medicine in I'm terrible. And there was nothing of the books and so on in abundance, but no medicine. The archives. Oh god. Then he's Oh god no. <laughs> Look, just to be sure, where did the three of you go? Someplace called the Bee Garden. The beautiful garden. It was kind of like a park with trees and stuff. 
but yeah. the baloney garden. <laughs> Maybe some medicinal plants. <laughs> go cut. Go get the herbs. Herbal medicine. No. Very more herbs. <laughs> oh, I thought you meant like different kind <laughs> of herbs. Oh, thank God. Crap, we're he's away. fine, get everybody. Away from me. <laughs> what? Oh yeah, he's I definitely have fine. What? what are you talking? About? Isn't it up? I have, but like. Stop. No. I could use a hand right. here. On it. Me too. Stop it! Let go of me. Get over here. All oh, right. I have, they can't believe you have to let them tr let me I have kill some any kill can <laughs> kill kill Somebody kill the scrapple away from me. and I hope it wasn't Alice uh, <laughs> <laughs> Luna yes are there any no well what there's so that's the one that good hit him he'll be it's just it won't but just her come on Luna. okay let me just Inject the child. Knock him out. Good. Wait. Now. Right. No. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Accept your fate. <sighs> Restoration. Aunt. According to. He's fine now. Yes. Now he will what no longer try long to. Shouldn't wake up. Uh. Daddy. Sure what I think that might be the vibe it probably yeah? admit huh? the well the, the um, scalpel to know self. About this oh, I prob all I've seen Why would I lie? I've seen other viruses do the So when yes, at least um. What are you doing? I turned and followed Tamichi's games. Oh no. Yeah. As expected. Another one of these timelines. I mean, we are on the Alice route, just the one where we betrayed her. <laughs> We're all going right. to die. Huh? We're all dead already. Only terrorists would resort to biological warfare. But they will. Soon. Uh, hey, Some more context for crazy about? lines, though, at least. You don't understand? Mm. All of humanity is going to die. The virus will spread. Adults. Children. Everyone. Everyone! There won't be anyone left! I... I'd rather die here! Wait, Alex. You were too stunned to watch as she ran away. Where'd she go? You lost her! Yeah. Well, let's split up quickly. Right. Look, just do your best not understood. Ten Miyoji, the rest of us sound good? I stay. Alright, let's get going. And then everybody ran, ran all over the place. Let's check the lounge. Maybe she went to go hang out. <laughs> nope. And check the beautiful garden other place to hang out. Not the beautiful garden, the baloney garden. The Bologna garden. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that it's spelled like that. <laughs> Why can't it just be spelled like you think it's spelled? Okay, this episode is now 59 minutes long. You want to split it here? Sure. Okay, everyone. If you enjoyed this, <laughs> liking, subscribing, commenting, and sharing are all appreciated. The most important thing that thou must absolutely do is have a nice day. Oh, you thought- oh, okay, you were waiting for me, oh. No, um. I just forgot my line, it's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, bye.